Hey guys, your boy Kurt Perez, and welcome back to Mass Effect 1, where last time I left off, I he was, um, I met a hoe on Citadel, apparently there are loads, and off camera, I've gotten, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's not, uh, that's not Caden, and that's, that, that's not Ashley, that this is Tali and Rex, <laughs> we also got, uh, Garrus. So, yeah. Now, Come on. Udina's presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You, you wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. She must be working with the Geth, too. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the Conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. You did that that for is for not good fast. enough! You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region. Keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Best, sir. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. Send I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council, and it was a human who exposed him. I've earned this. Ha. Uh -huh. Lol. Yeah, that's right. It be, it's, it's learning. Place. Commander Shepard, step forward. Oh. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. 
This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Oh, God, I've been ready for this since Eden Prime. We're sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. I'll find him. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Huh. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. Hmm. Bastard didn't even thank you. What do you expect from a politician? Come on. Right behind you, Shepard. Charm? No one wants charm. Since I'm a Spectre now, can I just... No, I have... Congratulations on becoming the first human Spectre, Commander. I'm certain you'll be up to the challenge. Who told you I was a Spectre? I'm a senior officer with the Alliance. I knew about your candidacy before the Normandy was sent to Eden Prime. My name is Admiral Kahoku. It's about time the Alliance got one of our own in with the Spectres. We need people like you to deal with our problems. Is something wrong, Admiral? I'm getting stonewalled by bureaucratic assholes. <laughs> Nothing new. Maybe you can help me, Shepard. One of my recon teams was investigating some strange activity out in the Traverse. We lost contact yesterday. Now I can't get clearance to check it out. Suddenly it's a restricted area. But that doesn't apply to you, Shepard. Spectres can go anywhere they want. You could find out why my team dropped out of contact. We'll see. I'll look for them if I have time. Well, that's more than most will commit to. I'm gonna stay here and see if I can find anything out through official channels. Won't hold my breath, though. Damn right. I'll upload the info on where my team was last seen. Unless I tell you to, in which case you'll, you'll do it and you'll, you'll like it. Hell my way. I hope he's okay. Don't be ridiculous. The Volus won't be joining the council for years. I'm not so sure. The humans are making a strong push. And you can... I thought that was Karis for a second. I was like, Karis, what are you doing here? One sec, looking you up. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Who wants to know? Just checking for CSEC records. I can only sell goods to authorized personnel. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Show me what you've got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Well, this must be a mistake. System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. Oh boy! Hey, all the stuff I get. <laughs> Look at that, that's... stupid. Can't afford that. Can't afford that. Mm -mm. <laughs> Keeper. Mate. Give. Near. 
start first before I get the hell out of here. Nope, don't see any, don't care. Alright, where am I supposed to go? Hmm. Med clinic, am I supposed to go there? Uh, huh. I have absolutely no idea where I'm supposed to be going. I know I'm supposed to go back to Normandy, but I don't know where it is. I guess I can do that since I'm here. Word on the street is that you've been busy. Congratulations on taking down Fist. I was sure he was a big player in anything going on here. Did you find anything in his office that could help me? These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. You've got this files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. Hmm. You won't I had to more. kill people for these discs. They're worth more than you're offering. I didn't tell you to kill Fist! But you're right. I suppose that I did ask you to help me, so here, this should be more than <laughs> adequate. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, I love the ring. So sweet. So fun. No, I wasn't supposed to come this way. Damn good idea that I did. Oh, those are two more points. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Obsidium. This is financial district. I guess I can go to her and tell her everything's sorted before I leave. I'll probably be back at some point. But better to do it now. Get it over with. Get the experience. Get the credits. Maybe I can get some renegade points as well. <laughs> oh, they've given me too much power. Commander, I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. I can't spend gratitude. I would not dream of letting you go without payment. I do not make a habit of incurring debts. These credits will cover your expenses. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. I'd be honored. I offer a gift of words. 
An affirmation of who you are hmm. and who you will become. I, think we're just I see you. Your uniform fits as though you were born wearing it. You are a soldier through yeah, and through. It comes proud, right off. solitary, alone. <laughs> but it gives you strength. You never hide your strength either. It serves you well, terrifies your foes. Few will dare to Damn stand right against you. My foes. This may be who you are, but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. Uh, thanks, I guess. Close your eyes and relax, Commander. <laughs> oh, you're gonna do all the work? <laughs> I told you. Here, Commander, in light of your efforts with the Elcor Ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. What is it? A small mystery. I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. Remember my words, Commander Shepard. They will give you strength. Did you enjoy the show, Tali? Ian Rex? <laughs> I wonder, were they standing there watching that the whole time? That would be kind of weird. They're, they're, they're into that shit. Oh, that was brilliant. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Maybe we should talk so about much it. empty space. Nope. A thousand of talk. my people could live here and hard to see each other. I don't want to talk about it. Tourism Terminal 2. Seriously. 